Next, I'm going to discuss about the trend method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main method. Here after that, go inside. So right here, I have taken three integer variable. First is m. Next, i. And next, i. So right here, I have taken one more variable integer variable a double r so this is array tab so right here i have given the size 55 so maximum you can enter 55 elements into the array so if you want more then here you increase the size next i created new keywords scanner system dot in and here after system dot r dot println so whatever in double code that display into the output screen and whatever i'm going to enter so that received by n so i'm going to enter n value 5 so here system dot auto pdl so this or display into the output screen into the elements of array and here uh, control comes to for loop so right here i value start from 0 so right here this is i and I start from 0 and check the condition 0 less than n value i into 5 so 0 less than 5 condition is to that coincides so a double r i is equal to sc dot next int so let's enter integer value into a double r 0 position so this is uh, a double r This is a zero index. This is one, uh, two, three, four. So a double or zero position. Let's enter element. So I'm going to enter fourteen. Here after that loop continue. So I increase. So I is one now. Check the condition one less than five. Condition is two. So that coincide. So let's enter a double or both position new element. So right here I'm going to enter nineteen. Here after i increase, so i is now 2 or check the condition 2 less than 5, condition is 2 so that coincide here, yeah. so let's enter a or 2 position new element so add here I am going to enter 4 here after i increase, so i is now 3 or uh, check the condition 3 less than 5, condition is 2 so let's enter a or 3 position new element so add here I am going to enter 23 again i gonna increase, so i is 4 now or uh, check the condition for less than 5 condition is 2 so let's enter 8 or 4 position new element so right here I am going to enter 9 I increase so I is now 5 at here check the condition 5 less than 5 condition is so uh, not true so not coincident here control comes to this point so 8 or 0 position value go to high so 14 comes to this point comes to high here after control comes to this point so right here i value start from 0 again and check the condition 0 less than n value 5 condition is to that coincide here if a double or 0 position greater than high so a double or 0 position 14 high value 14 14 greater than 14 condition is not to not coincide here after that go up and increase the value of i so i is now 1 check the condition 1 less than 5 condition is to that coincide so right here a double or 1 position greater than high so one position is 19 and high value 14 so 19 greater than 14 condition is to that coincide so right here 8 or on one position value go to high so one position 19 so 19 go to high so high become 19 here after that out from if again that go up increase the value of i so i is now 2 or check the addition 2 less than n value 5 condition is to that coincide so at a or 2 position greater than high so 2 position is 4 and high value is not 19 so 4 greater than 19 condition or not true not coincide here after i increase so i is 3 now or uh, check the condition 3 less than 5 condition is to that coincide so at a or 3 position greater than high so 3 position is uh, 23 and high value 19 so 23 greater than 19 condition is to so right here, 
8 over 3 position value go to high. So 3 position 23, 24, 3 go to high. So high become 20, 23 now. Here after that out from if again that increase the value of i. So i is now 4. Change the condition for less than 5 condition true that coincides. So at a if 8 over 4 position greater than high. So 4 position is 9 and high value or 23. So 9 greater than 23 condition not true, not coincide. Hereafter I increase, so I is now 5. So at your change the condition 5 less than 5 condition not true. So that not go to inside of all loop. Here control comes to this point system dot auto print align method. So at your whatever you don't code that display into the output screen and here that concatenate plus operator then concatenate high value so high value is 23 so that can concatenate so the output comes the highest number is in array column 23 and hereafter that output main method so I enter n value fine so here I total enter elements of fine so if you want then you can change the n value so right here you can enter 7 also 7 8 13 20 15 or 15 because right here i have given the condition 15 so right here uh, 5 7 8 12 or 15 maximum so if you enter 15 so here you can enter 15 elements into the array so that same dryer method or uh, here also you have to do so you should try to enter 15 next to uh, do the same trial method so you will get expected output so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week